Hey guys, it's Ghost Boy Ghoul again. Um, so, since last week, or whenever I uploaded that video, I don't think it's been a whole week, but uh, there has been an update, um, including a new potential kind of route you can take because of the trance abilities. Uh, there was a bug with the trance abilities that um, actually lowered a certain stat and increased another, but you can kind of take advantage of the, new, of the uh, up 30 score now uh, from the Condor and lower your attack and get all that attack back. With this, I have been able to take the Reno route now, um, and I just unlocked um, Ifrit's Hellfire and Shiva's, Shiva's Diamond to Dust, which I made videos on uh, S Plus ranking Ghost Crisis Dungeons too, just in case. So now I have got a better score since, and very hard, um, but I've also lowered in rank since my last video because so many people are getting better scores. Uh, so. <clears throat> Yeah, anyways, there's some people's names there for you, um, who's in the top of my pool. Anyways, uh, I'm gonna go in, I've got Hellfire and Diamond Dust now, so I think I'm gonna be able to, uh, do, do a lot of work, uh, let's see here. Just a moment, let's see. Okay, Event Dungeon, I called this one. I think I've got to equip uh, the summons. Yeah. Okay. White out to Diamond Dust. This is my first time actually going to be able to use this, which is really cool. I'm excited. And then uh, I think Aerith had this, but she's going to have Hellfire instead now. Alright. So quick rundown of my stuff too, I guess. Uh, I'm just gonna go super quick, you know, that, like I've obviously spent a bit of money on this, but you can do what I'm doing with um, a lot less of these stats. You don't need all the same equipment, but you kind of just want to pile on uh, the stats that these characters are using. If they're physical attack user, give them physical attack. Uh, the elements pay, play a big part in it. So because he's got a nice, a really strong ice move and a decent area effect fire move, here, I'm packing fire, I'm packing ice. Um, I might even want to give that fire to Aerith because she's holding effort now. This one here. Um, maybe I'll trade that for this. Let's see. 26 and 9. That could be worth it. That's something I'm going to do. I'm going to trade this for Barrett's Flame Tour, which is equ equipped to Sephiroth right now. I call it the Flame Tour. I think it's called. Uh, uh, flame projector. Okay. There we go. We're gonna switch that. Now she's gonna take advan more advantage of that with uh, Ifrit. Even though Sephiroth was kind of using it with this, uh, he gets enough fire uh, stat with this alone here. Um, so it's it's fine. Anyways, all right. There's the squad. Um, feel free to pause on anything if you wanted to see uh, more of that. I I kind of went through it pretty quick, but. I kind of want to just get through this a little quick too. I want to see if my score improves here. Alright, here we go. All right, so this is going to be a slightly different um, path to what I did last time, too. Because I am going to take advantage of the new bug. The song can make for a sick drum and guitar cover, or just full band cover in general. Okay, I'm already playing this wrong, but it's okay. Uh, give him a Diamond Burst. Give him Aerial Frostblade. Give him a Night Bloom. Yeah. You, you can tell it's been a day since I played this. <laughs> Alright, we went up pretty quick regardless. Heavy damage, let's go. That's what I like to see. 
I learned a lot uh, doing this since the last time too. Oh, and in my last video, I, I mentioned in the comments, but that's not very clear. Uh, I, I discussed how this fiery condor does not take debuffs. That is incorrect. Um, they just don't get, uh, whatchamacallit. Uh, I don't think they get magic defense down or something like that. There's a specific debuff that they don't get. I, I'll double check that right now. But they do get the ice down from like Lucia's gun or an ice breach. Um, which clearly happened in that video when I overlooked it entirely. So here, I'll, I'll show that in a second. But here you want to take advantage of this, the minus attacks. And then you're going to go straight over to the three ice soldiers. Um, and get all this attack right back. And uh, this way it's you're going to get more score boost out of... Uh, the whole dungeon. But anyways, let me show you, uh, because I'm curious myself too, the Fiery Condor's little uh, debuff stuff here. Immunity's magic defense down, that's what I was thinking of. Look, so if Aerith hit, hit him with Night Bloom, um, they're not gonna lose any magic defense down because the bird's immune. That's all I meant, um, and I completely butchered what I was saying. Anyways. Okay, here we go. Now we're gonna fight this little mob here. We're gonna get a little uh, limit gauge and ATB gauges up. What's the limit? I really don't like those bugs, but I found it a quick way to kill them. If you don't kill the ones on the left and the right side, and just focus on the guy in the middle, once once he dies, it's all over. Um, that's not too bad. So in here, if you go like this, and you just focus on little weak moves like this, Ruin or Blow, Ruin or Blow, and you just keep switching to everybody, it makes sure that everybody keeps using Ruin or Blow, which is going to be the weakest move you can possibly do in here. And I've got the Blows on instead of Ruin Ruz because of Behemoth. Um, if you use Ru Ruin Ra on Behemoth, then uh, <clears throat> it's not going to be good. He's going to come back with Flare, and he's going to wipe your party, or do really heavy damage that you don't want to get hit by. Now this poison is not nice. I do not like the poison. But we're just going to heal that with Kiraga. Yep, that, good job, Aerith. Um, more Ruin or Blows. More Ruin or Blows. Heal this, come on. Okay. I, I've, I've had enough of the poison. So we're going to get rid of these guys. The, the, the fact that I switched to attack stance there allowed uh, Sephiroth and Aerith to do... Or Sephiroth and Lucia to do heavier stuff. Okay, this guy's weak to ice right now. He's dead right now from this. Yeah. Alright. Alright, here we go. Now I'm going to skip Behemoth and come back to him. Because you want to take these guys out for the uh, the trance ability pretty well right now. But I also want Aerith's um, limit break up for these guys specifically. So I'm going to go do that. Notice how hers is less than everybody else's. Because she's been healing. You get That's what I've been... Uh, I said. I think I mentioned this in my last video I just made. Or earlier. I'm getting, I'm getting all mixed up here. Or earlier in this video I mean. But, uh, the more attacks you do, the, fa the faster your limit gauge builds and your summon gauges. And because she's been healing, it doesn't gain as fast during, like, uh, moves like heal and whatnot. Moves that actually do damage are going to fill those gauges quicker. Okay, here we go. All right, now I've still got the area of effect move here, uh, but we won't. But we don't want to kill him too quick. We real, we really want to um, get some ruin or blows here. But we want to kill at least one of these guys because we don't gotta want to get hit by a big move. Okay, Eris, let's get some ruin or blows in. Get get that gauge up. Ruin or blows. Ruin or blows. Ruin or blows. Go ahead, hit me. Ruin or blow. It really didn't fill that much. It filled a little bit, which is unfortunate because I wanted to use a Hellfire right away in this battle, but what can you do? You might want to um, try to take your time a little more with these guys. My guys might be just too strong. They're going through them too quick at this point. I don't know. But uh, 
Okay. You want to fight, fight these guys next no matter what. Limit Gidge or not. I'm gonna go ahead and use um, my other limit breaks anyways. Just so they start refilling. Let's, let's go. Let's do it. My first time using Diamond Dust. Right here. Right here with you guys, whoever's watching this video. Alright, my first time using Diamond Dust. I'm not gonna skip it. You know, I've seen it a bunch of times already. It's cool. That's heavy. Huge damage. Huge damage. I don't even need effort. Okay. Let's go. Faraga. Take him out. Take him out. Alright, this allows me to use effort at the beginning of the behemoth, I guess. Switch. And then that'll allow the whole behemoth fight to recharge it. And through the next bugs. I call him the bug. Um, to get in time and get ready for Reno. Uh, these guys are fire. I'm not gonna use that, I almost did. He's dead, he's dead, he's dead, he's dead. Okay. Now we're gonna get that stat boost back. go score boost oh wait no no not that we're gonna want to avoid this this is what i was going for before because i wanted the score boost but now you're getting all your attack plus 10 back we don't even need healing and we still have the up 30 score boost from the first one which is gonna outweigh this up 10 so yeah we may not be taking advantage of every single score boost out there but we're gonna be taking advantage of more and we don't have all that attack deduction <laughs> okay now we're going in here and we're going to use Hellfire right away and allow it to recharge. And this might even take out it, uh, Behemoth's two little minions. I'm not certain yet. This is my first time using it. So, right here with you guys. Using Hellfire. Skip the little scary intro. Use Hellfire. I probably could have done a, a Fire Breach. Oh, wait. You know what? Behemoth is immune to all that stuff. No point. No point in a Fire Breach. He's not weak to fire or ice. So yes, it took out the minions. Awesome. Let's go. So now let's just go right into the heavy hit. Heavy hit. Bam. That's a heavy hit. Let's go. More heavy hit. More heavy hit. More heavy hit. Okay. Let's go. Can I just do one more? Oh man, it's rough for the health. Maybe I should get a heal in. Heal. Oh, she used a Blizzaga. She used a Blizzaga right before I switched to defense mode. If I switched to defense mode, she had enough ATB. She could have got a Kira Kiraga in there. Now I'm going to have to use a Kiraga uh, during the bugs. Which is a little unfortunate. But it's fine. It's all fine. If I die to the bugs... Oh, that's so upsetting. It's okay though. Because I won't. Alright, now we're going to take the score boost. We don't need as much heal. Even though we're going to be healing right away, it's not a huge loss. Aerith is such a good healer in the first place. Alright. I really got to get a heal in here before I die, too. Sephiroth is going to want to do the aerial uh, frostblade again. Um, get the get a healing, get a healing, get a healing. Yes. Okay. We're gonna need more than one heal. Get another healing. Get another healing, Aerith. Come on, girl. Come on. Okay. This is brutal. All the poison. Oh, I hate these guys. And uh, you want to get the first guy. Um, heal. Please, somebody- Oh, Lucy is dead. 
That makes me really want to use a tent, which is unfortunate. Because I really wanted to go through this without items. But it's okay. Is it okay though? Is it okay? She had her limit break and now it's gone. We're gonna, we're, we're gonna upload this run anyways. At least you guys can see what not to do. This might not be my best run. I'm gonna have to go at it again, but... Okay. We're, go we're going... Um, both. Let's see back with 1 HP here. Ugh, man, that's so unfortunate. See, that's what that's what happens when you play risky. Alright. We're gonna take advantage of what we can here. Alright, so... Blizzard. Fire. Mmm. More... More fire. Ah, oh, yeah, screw it. Everybody. She doesn't need that fire. Let's see here. Okay. Anyways, use the items if you have to, like I always advise, and here you go. Here you guys go finally seeing these items. That's an example for how to use an item. Okay, we're going in. Yeah. Items in general. May not be my, my best run ever, but who knows? Maybe Hellfire and uh, Diamond Dust Diamond Dust will make all the difference. Not only does it hit harder, but it hits area of effect, which is going to be super useful for these guys because you really want to kill these guys on the left as soon as you possibly can. If they get the attack boosts up on Reno, you are absolutely done. So here we go. We are gonna get uh, one of these in, and then we're gonna use Diamond Dust, and this should take out the two Elite Sentries on the side. It would have been nice to use uh, Hellfire for this one too, but it's fine. Okay, good, good. Now we're okay. We're A-OK. -okay. Let's get a Fire Breach in on him because, uh, Ifrit's coming up anyway. There's no point in that. Let's just go into this. I was about to use Aerial Frostblade, but it wouldn't have come out in time. Aerith can use Kiraga. She better use Kiraga right now. Okay, there we go. All that ice down from uh, Lucia. Thank you, Lucia, for using that move from Bald Eagle. It's appreciated. Okay. We're gonna switch to defense mode. That's not gonna get on time. Please, no one die. Ooh, she almost died. That's so risky. So scary. Get Kiraga in. Oh, she's stunned. Gosh darn it. Come on, Aerith. I need your cure. Oh, sh shoot. She died. <laughs> she died, guys. It's okay. Not my best run out there, but uh, it's done. I might get a higher score than uh, what I had before regardless. Let's see what I got. Regardless, it is beaten. I'm still gonna upload this video regardless. And hopefully I get a higher and yes, that's higher. That's uh that's a new record for me. Let's go. So Hellfire and um Diamond Dust were, were worth it. Uh, I can probably get a better run than this. I'm gonna upload this run regardless. Let's just see where I am on the Alright guys, uh so there you have it. Um my I'm 29th in the rank now. My game just crashed, so I had to re-upload, but I'll clip that in the video. Um, regardless here, uh, I do have a better score. It saved, even though my game crashed, so that's nice. And uh, I'm now 29th, which, as for the... I think we're in uh, the final day of it at this point. That's not too bad. That is really not too bad. So, I'm in pool 12. And uh, just to give recognition to everybody above me here. Uh, here we go. I'll just scroll through it a little slower. I'm probably gonna get a bit of a better score because I'm gonna rerun that probably off camera uh, But I think that especially being the final day that's gonna guarantee me the top 100 I'm probably not getting top 10, but I'm um, doesn't hurt to try. I'm gonna rerun that a few times before uh, this events over and uh, and go from there All right guys um, <clears throat> All right guys. Yeah Thanks for uh, thanks for joining and uh, 
hit that like or dislike subscribe buttons and uh give me a follow on twitch i'd appreciate that uh ghost boy ghoul on twitch i'll throw the link in the description all right guys uh good luck have fun take care peace